Hi everybody, happy Tuesday. I wanted to do this little vlog on my way to work to tell you about an experience that I had this morning that I'm really excited about. Of course, this has happened to me many, many times, but this one in particular, I got permission to share on social media. And I really don't like sharing personal stories from somebody else on social media if I did not get permission. I don't think that's respectful. Now, if somebody puts something out on YouTube and I want to talk about that I saw it, well, it's already public knowledge. But this was private. And about a year ago, I was visiting a friend and we just had a nice visit. I wasn't working on this particular day and before we got you know ready to end our visit I was going to be leaving and traveling home. I got a psychic hit. Now a psychic hit is a word or phrase or can be a download of information <clears throat> that is given to the person that is open to receive it. And some people are just open to receive most of the time. Some people get psychic hits when they're supposed to. So it really doesn't matter how, when, or why. It just happens. And before I was getting ready to leave with this friend, I got a psychic hit. And the psychic hit was, I am supposed to tell you to pay attention to the key. Now, I don't know if you lost a key. I don't know if it's a lock on a door. I don't know if you need to get a key or find a key. I'm just saying the hit is pay attention to the key. And so we're sitting there and she's saying to me, gosh, I don't know what that could mean. I mean, I could have my locks checked on my doors. I said, well, do you have a safe? Is, did you lose a key for that? And we're going on and on and, you know, left it at that. We just, neither one of us knew exactly what that meant. <clears throat> so being the person that this person is, she put this in her back burner of her mind. And she said to herself, you know, I don't have a spare key. And... I live alone and perhaps I should get a key, a spare key, just in case for emergencies. So she put this off and she put this off and finally she went out and got a spare key and she put the spare key where only she would know where the spare key is. So. A few months later, she is someplace else. And she got several phone calls on her cell phone that there was an emergency. And there was an alarm going off in her house. And they contacted her son and said, there's an alarm going off in your mother's house. We don't know how to get in. And he contacted her and said, where are you? We can't get in. You don't have a spare key. And she said, well, yes, I do. I went and got a spare key. So she told her son where it was. They got into the house. It was 
the smoke detectors were going off in her house and they needed to be replaced. Long story short, the psychic hit about the key had to do with that. So she contacted me by phone this morning to tell me she was so excited to tell me that the psychic hit that I got was correct. Now, that was about a year ago. And some of you may know, some of you may not know, but when I do a psychic reading or get a psychic hit, oftentimes I tell people, now, this could happen tomorrow, this could happen three months, six months, but typically my readings are a year in advance. I don't know what, why that is, but I have had other experiences like this where people have come to me and said, you know, when you told me such and such and such and such a year ago, it's happening now. So I wanted to put this vlog up today on my way to work in the form of a YouTube channel. So when you go on to my Light Fragments Oracle Card videos, where I do a timeless reading, you might think to yourself, well, this does pertain to me, sort of, but I don't see this happening. If you get a feeling that it might be you, it could be a year from now. And I just wanted to throw this validation out. And you know, I mentioned I got permission to do so. Just so you guys will know, when you click on one of my readings, it is applicable for you at that time. And it may not transpire for a year. So I hope you all have a wonderful, blessed day. Be well, be blessed, be beautiful because you are, because there is something about you that nobody else has that makes you the beautiful person that you are. Until next time, bye-bye.